Uh, we're already seeing an increase in people heading out to the airport to get away now that the restrictions are easing up on COVID. So what are airports doing to protect travelers that may be suffering from COVID and not know it? Ursula Perry has details on what could be coming to our airport one day soon to keep us all safe from COVID-19. These travelers arriving from down south at Flint Bishop Airport in Michigan are greeted warmly by an officer. How are you? But what they don't realize is hiding behind the visor on her helmet is a tiny camera scanning their temperatures. It red flags anyone registering 100.4 or higher. 97.4 degrees. The smart helmet is a new tool to help detect COVID-19. The brain of it is uh, right up here in the top. It has a camera on the front of it right here, and it also has an infrared camera on the Picatinny rail on the side of it here. Um, that's thermal imaging. The helmet can scan up to 30 people at a time from 21 feet away. It was developed by a company in Italy and first used in Rome. When we started the first with the pandemic, we did take temperatures just remotely with an officer here at the door, but we were missing the uh, people coming off the plane, and that was a big gap. The display on the inside looks like a 72 inch screen in front of the user's right eye. It's giving the flying community some added peace of mind. Only one person at the Flint Bishop Airport in Michigan was found to have a fever through this method. But then again, a secondary reading showed she did not have a fever. It's believed it was because she was wearing a big heavy coat and a mask, something you likely won't see at the San Antonio Airport this summer. Ursula Perry, KSAT 12 News.